We did have a developing situation further on the northeast side, closer to Live Oak, 1604 and Nacogdoches. Let's go ahead and check out with the latest there with Katrina Weber, who is live there on the scene. Katrina? Well, police are working to clear up uh, what the situation. This has been going on for uh, the better part of an hour now. A uh, man who was hit and killed by a tow truck. Let me show you what's happening up here. We still have police up there. I also saw members of the medical examiner's office here a little while ago. I think that they have started to clear out. And it looks like police have now uh, just contained this to one lane because this entire exit ramp to Nacogdoches was closed at one point. I'm not sure. I have to take a closer look whether uh, part of of that is now open. The main lanes were not affected by this uh, accident at all. Police tell us that the tow truck driver says that he didn't see the man until it was too late. A man crossing uh, that road, that exit ramp area, was hit and killed by that tow truck. Now, the tow truck driver was not charged with anything. Police say he did stop to try to help the man. He cooperated, uh, and so he was able to get back on the road, but police have still been here to finish their investigation, and it looks like they are starting to wrap things up again, uh, or, or as I say again, because it looks like at least part of this exit ramp is now open. Reporting live on the northeast side, Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.